Hello, my sewing fans. My name is Lena Breed, and uh, this is my sewing channel. And today I'm gonna show you what I'll be sewing last week. It was um, Do It, uh, Do It Mondriani style. Pete Mondrian is a Dutch painter, and um, I really love it. He is uh, abstract art. And if you saw my last video about uh, sewing plants for spring, summer uh, 2019, so you know that I bought a boiled wool. I thought to make a coat or a bombier or something else from this wool, but I understood that boiled wool is not good for clothes. It's better to make a it because I really need it here in England. I took a piece of paper from KH copybook and now I want to show you how it looks like is my patterns with patterns of my uh, do it where one cage is uh, five centimeters everything you can see here in centimeters and um, everything you need just um, to understand what sizes of your do it should be sizes of my do it is um, a single size is um, 200 centimeters to 135. I have um, a single duvet cover. You can use uh, your sizes. Um, it doesn't matter what kind, but the Kinshu copybook will help you. On the way, I bought a wadding, cotton wadding. Uh, in info box, I will leave a link where you can buy the same. So, this is my wadding. I already cut uh, my um, uh, bullet wool. Now I have to place it like I did uh, with my patterns. One by one, we do it with my data. After that, I um, cut my navy boiled wool. Uh, you can see lines here. One line is five centimeter wide. I need them to cover seams on my duvet. The next step is um, to connect um, my navy lines, my rectangle, bullet wool and my wadding by a plain seam. It needs uh, more time. I spent for that about two hours. And let's uh, be honest, it's not easy to do it on the floor. After that I went to Fabricland, it's a fabric shop in Bristol, and bought the um, 
BIOS tape that has the same color of white boiled wool. When I come back home, I am covered my duvetants um, with um, BIOS tape. When I'm doing a stitch on the blue wool, I use blue thread. On the white, I use white. The same on yellow, red or navy. After that, I started to fix my uh, navy lines, my um, boiled wool, and my wadding by zigzag. It seems to be zigzag is the best way for boiled wool. And um, to do it, uh, it's not easy because the dough it is really big, it's quite big. Anyway, I um, did my best. After that, I start um, testing my duvet. I put it in um, the um, duvet cover and after one week I um, uh, took it off uh, to see what's going on with it. And um, I understood that uh, I um, got a good decision to make a duvet. Do not uh, make a close uh, because boiled wool is not good quality. Uh, anyway, for do it is fine, but uh, inside, um, uh, with uh, on my body, I see that it's not good to leave it uh, without lining. And I went to do my um, lovely fabric shop, online shop, pound fabric, and bought there a cotton for my lining, lining for my duvet, of course. On this step, um, I have to uh, take off my um, BS tape, uh, cut my cotton, um, the same size like my duvet, and um, then uh, cover by a BS tape these three fabrics. Now you can see I'm almost uh, ready, ready to wear <laughs> uh, duvet. Uh, the last step is uh, to fix these three fabrics uh, and I um, got a decision to make something strange and different and I never tried it before. I'm using a pins. You see? Pins, um, for example, for this um, red part about 10 or 8 to 8 10 pins and then I'm going to the sewing machine and make a short stitch I do this stitch not only in red part also in yellow and blue and and uh, white these stitches um, help um, to all fabrics do not move to stay together and now you can see that um, there is nothing on the line on the back and on the face. So girls, that was my sewing process of uh, Mondriani style do it. I apologize for my English, it's not my native language, but I do <laughs> the best. I try to do the best. And I hope you like this video and I hope this will be an inspiration for you in your makes, sewing makes. See you next video. Goodbye.